Puzzles, games, they've been around since the beginning of time. In the 1980s, we met something called the Rubik's Cube. Was it a box or was it a bunch of boxes? Could you solve it? I couldn't. In 1980, Ronald Reagan was elected president, and the world lost a great musician. We lost John Lennon. It was like we lost a friend. But you know what else happened that year? We met a new friend. And that friend said, hey, it's hip to be square. That friend said, I'm hands on. I'm tons of fun, and I'll always be there when you're bored. That friend is still here today. That friend is more than a box. That friend is more than a cube. That friend's name? Here's the Feng Shui Shuang Run version 1. I got this at my first competition. Feng Shui Guang Yin. And I also have another Feng Shui Guang Yin, which I want to nice strike you in this contest. These are my YJP Red 3. The Formula Cube is essentially a rebranded Suong, so I have two of those. I also have a Qi Long and a Yu Long. The Gans 357, my first Gans puzzle. Here's my Kong Sazan Yin, in my opinion, a really underrated Cube Factory. Fun fact, I got my first official full step 7 on this Cube. This is a Qi Evil fight that I got from Alistair with the programming Cuber. I think this is the first Sickle Cube I ever caught. <laughs> A museum recognized it as a work of art. Rubik's Cube has been involved in divorce proceedings. People are practicing at clinics, entering contests, and competing across the country. Rubik's Cube from Ideal. 25 million Americans have made it a part of their lives. How about you? When I was 10 or 11, in the years 80 or 81, I was watching a show on television called That's Incredible. And there were these teens. They were having a competition on how to solve the Rubik's Cube. And this one kid, he solved it in less than 30 seconds. I was mesmerized. I was hooked. I asked my parents for a Rubik's Cube and the book on how to solve it. I got them both. I never read the book and I never solved it. 